Hey folks, we're picking up where we left off in the RimWorld 1.3 beta. We've built a little boomalo ranch, and we're doing some farming, we've got it in the hay, and we need to develop our barn a bit further because that's a bit piss at the moment. So what I'm going to do is start out by deconstructing this, putting in a wall, and now we've got gathered in some cloth from here. It means we'll be able to make an animal flap, and our barn will be lovely. And I might add some temperature control. I might have to like um, um, expand our power lines, which might mean um, expanding our walls as well, thinking about it, because I have started that. But it'd be nice to run the power lines down the walls for reasons of tidiness, I guess. But it also just um, forced me to actually start thinking about a um, bit more defensive action. A lot of what I'm doing is, at the moment, is expanding what we've already got. So I think, for instance, this this pen is going to get nice and big for if we get any other animals and stuff. I think we can mix animals, I don't think that's a big problem. And the barn, I'm, I'm trying to make that a little bit better. There's, the hay's going to be inside, for reasons. And now we've actually got some hay, we can actually put in some straw matting into the barn. So it's not just going to be a horrible stony ground. Right, oh this is actually going really quickly. Okay, so we can start laying the power lines now. We've got enough steel, 216, so that shouldn't be too much of an issue. That can go up to there, and then all the way from here to here, and then we can have uh, a cooler. Because I think even the even the animals will get heat stroke or something at some point. We just want to make the barn a nice, like, steady 21 degrees, I think. I think that's good. It'd be good for something, anyway. Actually, there is one thing we should do. Quests. Um, I've got a quest for a grand monument, which I think I will do, because it'll get us a new person. Oh, I could get some glitter will medicine. Who cares? Or oh, some good will. Oh! Oh, yeah, that'll pay my bills, won't it? Okay, except for you. So we need to build a fairly basic monument. What's that? Monument mark. Let's put it, th let's put it inside here. And that will be, I think... Uh, this is going to be crap. This, it, once we've actually just done, done the marker, it's going to be some crappy old stone affair. But uh, I think that's a royalty DLC thing. But meanwhile, Jacob is pla replanting the dandelions, which are getting air. Yep, the, the new haystock pile is there. We have some of this. Bulk? Good. So this is good. This, this should provide us with quite a few things. With any luck. Um, Eden apparently is cutting stone block from chunk. Where are you doing? Oh, you're doing it. That. Okay, that's where you are. Right, well, let's go and head you off at the pass. Okay, so what I've done is I've flogged a load of gold and um, the uh, the chem fuel that we've been producing, and I'm, I'm buying a male and a female turkey, and also a donkey, um, so we can expand our farm, something rotten. That'd be great, I think. So, except, we're also going to try and make as much money as I can. Yes, that is some seriously good uh, relations increases, and also some delicious uh, supplies. So, this field is going to be a more of a turkey field. <laughs> Uh, than, well, than before. Um, I should probably expand my dandelion zone a little bit, but it's not going to be very much. <laughs> but, um, we'll, we'll have to take down those bits of fencing. Uh, the barn hasn't quite finished being... Oh, get off! Stop trampling my crops, you bastards. Uh, the heel root is only 50% grown. It's okay, we, um, we don't need to use much medicine at the moment. Um, it's only really Jacob's asthma that um, we need that for. Uh, this is getting expanded. I, I really need to make my rooms a bit nicer, because they're a bit piss at the moment. I don't think people are very happy with them. Everything's very ugly. And there's also there's just dirt on the ground. Oh my god, there's so much dirt and, and crap on the ground. The other big problem is that we can't build on a lot of some of this sand over here. So I'm kind of like tempted to move the bedrooms away from here. Aha! The donkey and the ostrich. All of them have been led in. We've got a slight problem, is that there's a, there's a gap in the fence, but um, it's all getting sorted. Uh, meanwhile, someone needs to treat... Oh, Jacob! Your, your, yeah, your asthma needs sorting out. Oh, uh, that'll, that'll sort itself out. Um, Eden is leading the turkey again. Oh, back over to here, that should all be good. Solomon the monkey is just hanging out, even though you don't actually need to be in the fence. Have we got enough component at the moment? We've got 18, that's not much. We've got a tiny amount in the walls just there, <laughs> which we could mine out at some point, but don't hold your breath. There's lots of other stuff that we need to do. Oh, this has finally come down, so let's... Now we can actually build that. And we can also build the new thing. Uh, which... Just pause that, because something's happening. Uh, that comes under structure, I think. And we need an animal flap. Now we've got the cloth. So, yeah, this, that means the animals can go in and out of the barn without the temperature changing in the barn. Because we want the barn to be 21 degrees uh, once... Oh, so in fact, it already defaults to 21 degrees, so that's fine. Right, well, there's much to do. First of all, accept the steel axe. I'll have that. 
And we can give that to... Oh, Boomalome is pregnant! Yay, they've mated! Oh, lads. Oh, there you are. Boomalope number two. Slaughter it. No, <laughs> let's not do that. I dread to think what would happen if we tried to slaughter a Boomalope. Um, yeah, so we've got the gift, we've got the steel axe. We should give that to someone who's good at melee, actually. I think an axe is a good weapon. <laughs> um, Eden's actually very um, melee-ish. Um, these days, I don't think Eden has... Because I've, I've taken away someone's weapon. Oh, Samson. I, I took away Samson's weapon and gave it to Squirt. Um, Samson is... Samson's very melee-ish, so yes, you can have the axe. Wherever the hell that is. There's also there's, there's, there's also a knife. I think let's make this out of marble. I think that's basically it for that. The, they'll build that at some point. Although I really should actually deconstruct that because there's... Um, hang on. Let's, let's be doing that. Just because otherwise I'll have to go the very long way around. I forgot to put a door in, basically. Come on, Samson. Now you have access. Yes, good. Strong. Right, we'll leave that to it. Yeah, ranch is coming along nicely. Very nice indeed. I really want to make the barn a bit bigger, because I want to put some sleeping spots in there, as I was saying a while ago. I think. <laughs> uh, I still haven't found the bloody things. Oh, it's under furniture, that's right. So we may need, we may actually need some large animal beds for the boomalopes and stuff like that. Um, we, need, we can make it out of cloth, which is probably for the best. Yeah, so let's do that. Let's bung in a few of those. I think you can fit any animal, so we may as well make a load. We've got plenty of cloth, so that shouldn't be an issue. Uh, we probably won't need... We might as well just get rid of this. Um, uh, delete the zone entirely. And expand that. Oh, we can't actually expand that, but never mind. Okay, that's good. So this pen is actually large now. It's a medium-sized pen. Nutrition consumption is uh, is quite big. But that's fine, because we, we, have, we have the hay, and now we have the, the cloth animal flap, so they can come and chow down on the hay as necessary. Assuming that turkeys can eat hay... Never thought, I never thought to check. I think they can. Also, I just realised I planted potatoes and some dandelions here. Oh, <laughs> shit. <laughs> never mind. Hopefully the donkey will be safe. Um, not really, I'm not really in the mood for to breed donkeys, admittedly. I just, I just want them as a pack animal in case we do a caravan or something, but... Mm. So at least we can, we can also, be, oh, we can do eggs. Hopefully now we should be able to do eggs as well. Um, the first thing we'll do, I think, therefore is, what were you doing, marble, is expand the barn a bit, because, well, we are going to need the room. So I'm going to put an egg box in here somewhere. I'll just put it, I'll place it there. I don't, don't think we're going to need more than one. I don't know how this works, but apparently you place it down, and in fact, let's just have a read. A box with soft materials made to hold eggs. I'm making it out of steel. <laughs> Egg-laying animals will lay eggs in egg boxes if they can. Your haulers will take all the eggs out only when the box is full. The box also protects eggs from deteriorating outdoors, although it does not protect from temperature damage. Well, I'm doing it indoors anyway. Hopefully the um, the turkeys will know to go through the flap. The lovely, lovely flap. I really feel like I should get rid of these bloody um, potatoes. These half-grown potatoes. <laughs> Ooh. One of them laid an egg. Uh, and they brought it indoors. But I don't know if we should... F it's it's going to hatch in 4.9 4 days. I've never actually tried hatching before. But I don't think they're going to... Um, I don't think we really want it in a freezer. I'm wondering whether we should actually have a dedicated area indoors here. To, if we can place the egg there, uh, somewhere, um, that will hopefully hatch. But I've never, say, I've never done this before, so maybe it just uh, does it automatically. But it's just like if it free, I have a feeling if it freezes, um, you know, it'll, um, it just won't hatch. I don't know. Okay, so I have looked this up. Um, I'm going to make sure that. Fertilised eggs no longer get stored in there, and I made a tiny little stockpile just for fertilised eggs inside the barn. It looks like... Look, that's a very lively music. It looks like Squirt is already moving the egg, and that should now... Yeah, if, if that had frozen, that oh, completely, that would have spoiled the egg. Uh, but now it seems oh, okay. So we'll get, a, we'll get a bonus turkey out of this. So our farming adventure's coming along quite nicely now. So I'd forgotten about the monument, but Samson has been busy, or possibly Squirt, I wasn't quite sure. And now we have um, Cardenas, the inventor, uh, who's going to be very clever indeed. I think he's going to be doing all our research for us. At the moment, Jacob seems to do that, but we don't really want him doing that. We want Cardenas. Jacob got up to five, which ain't great. Uh, Squirt is only f four, so let's, let's actually make Cardenas the researcher and pretty much nothing else for the time being. Anyway. Cardenas joined, and monument complete. 
You must not destroy it for at least 15 days. Also, we need... Oh, shite. Yes, I should have been planning for this, shouldn't I? We need yet another bedroom. Oh, we have issues with the power. It looks like the wind has not been blowing. Or... We've just started to overload it. And we're still researching uh, water mills. This is taking a long time. Thankfully, Cardenas is on the case, and that should go a bit quicker now. Especially since um, that frees up Jacob. Although, research is the least prioritised thing, so it just probably wasn't doing it anyway. Right, a bit of unfinished business. Um, we're going to sort out the power. And we'll s while Samson's here, get the axe. That was going to get earlier. So you can do some melee action. Uh, yeah, I'm building a chem fuel generator. Um, so, and this is sort of like a temporary measure, since we've got the chem fuel, we may as well, but since we just don't have enough power in the grid, it seems to make sense to do this for now. But um, sooner or later, we're going to get the um, the whole watermill thing set up. Um, it should be sooner rather than later, because... Oh, Squirt's doing research! Oh! Oh! Not sure I like... Cardenas, stop! Okay, okay, that's, that's clearly, clearly not what we want. I think it's because I've actually left Squirt on as high priority for the research. Well, don't do that. That's silly. Um, Eden should be cutting up the the stone. Oh, Eden's just got food poisoning. God damn it. Stop chucking it up. We really need to actually clean this place up because it's so dirty. Um, it, there are people who are cleaners. Um, maybe I'll make Squirt, for temporary sake, um, a bit of a cleaner. Because nobody else seems to be doing it. Oh, hello. The turkeys are having a go at each other again. That's nice. We've also got a fertilised egg in the egg box. Um, okay, fine. I'm going to allow this. I'm wondering whether I should have more than one egg box. I don't quite know how that works, but... I think I'll just... Uh, we're not trying to eat the eggs. I think we are trying to just, like, get as many turkeys as we can. Just as long as we don't get too many and they eat us out of house and bloody hope. Oh my god, that's going fast. Oh, they're going to, going to have a little kippy-poos. That's all good. In my nice temperature control ban, which I am now expanding. Oh, the spuds are in as well. Okay. We, we, we don't need to worry about food anymore. What we do need to worry about is getting these rooms a bit nicer. Aha! Right, finally got the water mill. And I'm tempted, definitely tempted to get tree sewing on the go. So we can finally get some wood. But we've got a little bit of wood and we're not really using it for anything else. Well, just not using it at all. Um, we, can make some, we need to make some clothes for our newcomer as well, Cardenas. They're wearing tattered apparel at the moment. Um, what else do we actually need? Biofuel refining? Hmm. Probably not. Oh, well, stuff's happening. I'm, I'm, I'm going to research a harp, <laughs> which sounds a bit stupid, but I really want to make sure that recreation gets sorted. We have a little flash storm. Thankfully, it's pretty... Uh, oh, God. It's reasonably far away from stuff, and thankfully our colony isn't made of wood for once, so that should keep the firestorm from the door. And that's it, basically. Yeah. That really is it. <laughs> yeah, not the most exciting thing in the world. I'll chop that wood. Bloody cactus. Boomalope 2 has given birth. Yay! A little boomalope. Finally, we've got a boomalope calf. And we've also got more eggs in the basket. We've got two eggs. And also the barn has been extended, finally. So we can finally put down the remainder of the floor. Very cheap, that. Nice little barn. We probably... I'm wondering whether we should actually put a light on in there. I don't know if them. I don't know if they need lights or not, but I'm going to give them one. Why not? I can put it there. There, a lovely, lovely barn made of several different materials. But shush. Uh, meanwhile, I'm expanding everyone's bedroom just to try and make them a bit happier, and putting down crappy old floor. I was going to make bedrooms elsewhere, but I decided not to. I might also move my beds around to make sure that we can have um, end tables and stuff, so we can make them even happier. Um, I'm making a new room, and I'm going to move my workshop into there, so it's a bit, so I can control it a bit better. So it's not just this cramped area. I'm going to make a little laboratory here, uh, move everything, all the other stuff over to here. Make some like a uh, tailoring benches, so we can give our new person some better clothes, etc., etc. Really. Oh, it turns out there is actually a raid, and um, so I'll just have to. I think are they? They're getting ready to attack. Oh, that should be fine. Now we've got plenty of lads, and there's only two of them, and we've got Squirt, who's an excellent shot. Right, so Samson, Eden, Squirt. Shall I arrange you? Well, we I could do with. I'll, I'll just do it. I'll just do a great big load of. I'll do a line of power. I think they're going to attack upwards. Yes, there they are. They can't come in the bottom way, really. And they're not. Look like they're not trying to breach us. So I think it's just going to be a case of. Shoot! Got you. 
Got you. Oh, you got some components. Um, ha Hakuya is not running away yet. Oh, careful. Right. Okay, mind the ostrich. I think maybe Squirt should um, make a bit of a dash for it. Cover fire! Run through the crops. Right, there we go. Get you. Bloodlust. Oh, don't shoot at the wall. Useless. Well, they're, they're a terrible shot. And not, it's not who pay attention to Squirt either. I thought Squirt was a good shot, but apparently not. I don't think... I think Samson has is is just got the axe, so let's just move you to there instead. That's more like it. just realised <laughs> all Samson has is an axe. Colonist need... Oh, Square got shot. Um, Maybe it's time for full frontal assault with the axe of truth. Go on, give him a good tonking. Tonk him. Actually... Oh, yeah, we got him. We got him. We got him. Uh, it's a 73-year-old town councilman. A uh, female councilman, apparently. Um, do we really want them? Not really. <laughs> They're a bit piss. Well, I'm wondering whether we should rescue them. I'm not quite sure why we'd do that. We haven't, we haven't really got a room to put them in. So just finishing off what we need to do in this episode. Uh, the turkey, uh, the baby turkey, um, has hatched and is running around somewhere. There he is. Um, turkey number three. Um, Jacob needs his asthma treatment. Uh, we just need to build the watermelon. That's basically everything that we need to do in this episode, I think. Can we build it? Not enough. Oh, we need... Oh, my God. We need so much wood. Oh. We've only got 15. We need 280. Ooh. Well, we've got... There's still a few cactus around, but that's only going to give us so much. So I think we may have to delay that until we get a decent source of wood. So just to round things off, I need, I do need to move... Oh, I need to put a light in there. I do need, do need to move all the productivity into here, just so... Yeah, let's also put in, make sure that we do actually have a floor. I'm just going with crappy old paved tiles. I will need to get more steel. I will need to mine some more out. But in the meantime, I can now be reinstalling that. Kind of there. The kitchen. I might leave this bit as a kitchen. I might have to divide it up, because the, the, if the research bench goes into here... And uh, that's going to leave some room. I can I can divide things off. Um, I'll try to make this a bit cleaner. But yeah, we'll see we'll see how that goes. We've got to the bloody raid. Just as I'm just uh, as I'm trying to finish things off, um, <laughs> sort of a double climax of the episode. Um, okay, well, so we can't do the watermelon anytime soon. So this will this will finish us off. Oh, we've got three lads. Oh, they're a bit tribal, so I don't think you need to worry too much, including James the sailor. Right, Samson can go there, Eden can go there. Oh, Samson has the axe. Mustn't make that mistake again. Right, this shouldn't be too bit bad, although Jacob may need to... Oh, headshots! Oh, you're getting good at shooting. Jacob may need to run away. Uh-oh. Jay! There's also a mad emu. Okay, hang on. Samson, you need to go and get stuck in. Don't, don't shoot Samson. Also, maybe you get out of the way. Ooh, careful, careful. Right, come on, Samson. Yes! Um, I never did actually get round to building a prison. <laughs> so, unfortunately, there's one. Okay, where, where's this mad emu? The final emu on them. Oh, my God! Oh, Moon! Moon is taking... Oh, Jacob. Jacob needs to get the hell out of there. Oh, no! Not Jacob! Okay, hang on. <laughs> that bullet's heading straight towards Jacob. Oh, God. Hang on. Be careful. Uh-oh. Come on. This is not good. Get stuck in. No, Jacob, no! Is this the end of Jacob? Hit it with an axe. Got it. Jacob needs... Oh, yes, it's Samson's taking some... <gasps> Eden, you shot Jacob! And I thought it was going to be Dark Esau who gets him, but no. Okay, hang on. Eden, rescue your friend. Sort him out. Meanwhile, Samson is doing the old chopper room. Okay. Well, we took a lot more lumps this time, but... Hang on, did I undraft you? There we go. Right. Someone rescue Jacob. I think Sam's... Oh, God, I must have cancelled that. Hang on. Try that again. Right. Go and get your medicine. And frankly, ouch. 
Ooh. Well, never mind. At least we um, we survived. Yeah, but anyway, yes, okay, so we'll stop here in terms of the actual Let's Play. I think I might continue on this as a bit of a stream at some point, but I think for the purposes of the uh, video, I think we're now complete. We've got a working farm, and things are breeding nicely, and we'll start to be able to slaughter things at some point. But we have plenty of eggs, fertilised eggs. There's four in there at the moment. So at some point, they will turn into even more turkeys, and it'll all be absolutely wonderful. Everyone's been tended nicely, Cardinaz is doing research, and our watermill, well... We do need a bit more wood. I'm trying to gather some more in from the rest of the map, but that's probably going to be uh, something that we either get a caravan for or buy. But Destroyed. Fresh tendered. What's wrong? Oh god, I think Jacob's been absolutely buggered here. Cracked, scratched, scratched, bruised, shot. Oh my god. Poor lad. No immediate danger. Oof, phew. Right, okay, so thanks for watching. Do subscribe to Randomized User to be notified when new stuff goes live. As I say, look out for any streams that I do continuing the story of the Randy's Ranch Colony, where hopefully we can actually get the farm even bigger. Uh, do um, uh, check me out on Patreon or buy me a coffee if you want to support the channel. Keep us going, and bye for now.